they first taught me about her, I was really inspired. And I was like, wow, I can't believe I'm walking in the place where a real astronaut was walking. I just really hope that we can keep like sharing her amazing story and showing kids that they can do what they want to do. And I feel even more inspired after learning about her to go for it. Here in Akron, a legacy of strength, smarts, and determination is not forgotten. Judy Resnick was a trailblazer, an engineer, a pilot, and only the second female American astronaut in space. Three, two, one, and liftoff. Her story cut tragically short by the Challenger disaster 35 years ago. Flight controllers here looking very carefully at the situation. Obviously a major malfunction. But her memory lives on in the voices of students from the very same school she once attended. No one can tell me that I'm just a girl and I can't do that. And I just remember the sadness of that moment. But I didn't want to focus on the sadness. I just wanted to focus on what an incredible person she was. I can do anything. Music teacher Kim Shamahanna wrote the song Full Throttle Up, which has become a tradition in the Akron Public Schools, especially at Judith A. Resnick Community Learning Center, the elementary school named in her honor in 2006. It's kind of a good opportunity to introduce them to her and let them know um, why her school is named um, after her. But on this anniversary year, a tribute concert would have to be held virtually, of course. This whole COVID situation, um, I wanted our kids to still be able to perform, perform. So I downloaded a program for video editing. It's, it's one thing to hear the words and kind of process the words, but it is a completely different experience when it is the voices of children who are singing those words. And it, it just, it's, it's so emotional. It touches me to hear them singing it. It is truly a blessing. The students we spoke with say they love singing the words that honor their hometown hero. Well, I like the part. It's kind of like between the middle and the end. It goes like, dance upon the moon, sing among the stars. I like that part. My favorite part of the song is uh, Never Heard of Limits because it's like nobody could limit her or she can't limit herself. Their teachers do too. I really like the um, who I am as a soul of a poet and a curious mind. I think I kind of identify with that a little bit too. A lesson in one woman's courage and inspiration that still rings true all these years later. You know, down the road, do you think that this is going to have an impact on you and the way that you think about things? Maybe. If I become the pilot, uh, then it could tell me that I might be scared to fly for my first time, so I can't limit myself. Basically, it's just really inspiring, and it tells you that you can do anything. You're not held back. We'll